French onion soup is perfect for rainy days, sad days, happy days. You're skiing on a mountain, you break your leg, you're in the hospital for years. You get out of that hospital, you know what you crave? A French onion soup. I'm Maddie Matheson, and I'm here to show you how to make the best French onion soup ever. What you have is a cheese, crunchy bread crust, deep, deep flavor. It's in my fucking beautiful cookbook called Maddie Matheson, a cookbook. It's selfish of me to keep these recipes to myself. I got a red onion, I got a Vidalia onion, I got just a yellow onion, I got a shallot, I got pearl onions. Ooh, shh, pepperonis. These are different sweetnesses, different bitters. They all actually taste different. We're gonna start off at a medium high heat. This is just vegetable oil, okay. Then we're gonna add some butter, unsalted butter. What we have here, two different kinds of fats. We got the neutral oil that's gonna allow the butter not to burn. We don't wanna burn butter. Butter, burr, burr. Burr's French for butter. So, shallots. Yeah! Look at this, see this little pot? See all these onions? Oh, fuck. So, we have a big bowl of onions, raw onions. It's gonna steam up, and all of a sudden we are gonna be left with just an absolutely incredible bowl of caramelized onions. There's nothing better than the smell of onions and butter cooking. Look at this. And you really wanna listen. What's it saying? And that noise is actually when the water is hitting in with the fat and the fat's like, ah, get away from me! Because oil and water, they are not buds. But you can add a little bit of, just a little bit of salt. And that will help draw out the moisture as well. We're putting a lid on it. This is a heavy lid. The bottom's on. I'm gonna turn this down low. So now I don't have to do fuck all for four hours. Oh. See, this, look at this. We're gonna add the wines. Here we go, everyone. One cup port. Yeah! One cup Madeira. Two cups sherry. So now what we wanna do is we wanna reduce this by half. That's gonna take, in my cookbook, I say two hours. We're gonna add the cipollini and the red pearl onion. What that's gonna do is just give us another flavor profile. Because right now we only have that caramelized, deep flavor, which is amazing but I really love that taste of like kind of raw onion. Oh, we got about eight cups of beef stock here. We've let it reduce by half, cooking off the alcohol, smelling all of the sweetnesses from the Madeira, the port, the sherry. Oh my goodness, look at this. Now what we're gonna do here is allow this just to live and boil and become itself. Just beautiful thyme leaves. Bay leaves, just give them a little crinkle, open them up a little bit. Beautiful. Oh, look at this French onion soup. Look at this. Oh, so rich, so oniony, so beefy. So we're gonna just bring this up to a boil. Okay, crostini time. Make sure you get a sourdough, and you can just slice it with a ring mold if you want. Yeah, there you go. We got our bread. It's okay to have a little crust on it. That's fine. We got a little palette knife here. We're gonna grill this up just like a grilled cheese. So edge to edge, lots of butter. Oh, fuck. Lots of butter. Butter's good. Put that in there. We're making it crunchy because we're putting that on top of this wet soup. We want it nice and crispy on both sides. None of this fake crispy business. I'm even gonna throw in more butter into the pan. Check this out. Yeah. You know what I like? Lots of butter. Oh, look at that. That's the motion of the ocean right there. So here's a little salt. Yeah. Get a ladle, stir it up so you have like not a big bunch of clumpy onions. You wanna just like kind of give it, you know, work it out a little bit. And we're gonna fill this up right up to the top. This is your big boy. So then you put your crostini on top like that. Then we're gonna put 
Is that freaking you out? Oh yeah. So then you put that much cheese on top. So it's quite messy, but you need to put that much cheese on top to make that cheese crust. Follow me. So we're gonna melt this cheese now. You wanna put it under the broiler until it just gets crispy and nice. Here we go. This is a French onion soup. See this? All the cheese melts down, caramelizes. The crust, crispy crunch on the exterior. Little char, a little bit of leoparding is always desirable. This is the plunge. <gasps> oh, look at this. Oh, mama. See that? That bite will burn your face off. Do not eat that, okay? I like to mix it all up. And then you just have like the onions and the cheese and the bread. You can eat all this stuff. Like you literally just scrape the edges. French onion soup is like, maybe not the prettiest at the party, but it's got the most friends, that's for sure. Oh yeah, it's so good. Oh, if the world ended, I'd want that to be my last bite. 